Today we would uh, uh, be demonstrating a, uh, a digital uh, temperature and humidity monitoring and a, a control system. Um, project is open already, so we we'll just do a quick one on this. Uh, the the project uh, is simply uh, is intended to produce in a farm uh, in an animal farm uh, where specific temperatures of uh, Maybe poultry fields, birds, or animals uh, is supposed to be is to be monitored and then uh, controlled. Uh, uh, different uh, uh, poultry fields like chickens uh, and the birds actually require uh, different temperature and some sets uh, uh, humidity level to be able to actually hatch their eggs and then uh, uh, grow uh, rapidly or grow or, or grow well. Apart from the nutrition. That they actually get uh, from their from their owners. Uh, this project is intended uh, to to monitor such a, a, a such a temperature and humidity, and then give readings. The the project uh, uh, is also intended to to have a, uh, to control a heater and air conditioner and and a fan. Uh, but uh, uh, the uh, on this model, we will be typifying those uh, 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 components with these three LEDs. Even though I'm actually yet to 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 write the the program for the conditions. Uh, for this uh, project to to be, it would need uh, a sensor. This is uh, the the temperature limited sensor. is a DHT22. We have a DHT11 and. Uh, other other uh, other types, but we have actually chosen to use the DHT to, to use the DHT uh, 22. Why are we using the DHT 22? The the properties uh, of the DHT 22 actually aligns with uh, the properties of uh, uh, the 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 quantities we actually want to uh, we want to monitor and measure. Apart from the temperature, apart from the temperature measurement sensor, which is the DHT 22, the system has an LCD. Uh, is 16 by 12 CD. Uh, that's light emitting diodes. Uh, we have uh, the mouth controller itself that they uh, actually interface with the, with the with the sensor, the LCD, and the light emitting uh, diode the indicators. <laughs> this is the mouth controller. We are using a PIC system of uh, 6872A. Uh, 6876A. Um, and uh, the secretary in bits, uh, in short, um, you have a, a voltage coming in from a, a 9 volt battery, a supposed 9 volt battery, uh, with a battery cap coming into a terminal block. Uh, this uh, can actually be replaced with, uh, with, a, with a charger, say a 12 volt charger, and then this other terminal block can actually sit a uh, rechargeable battery if, uh, if we intend to for it to. I mean to have one. Uh, so that's that's basically the physical assembly. Okay, so we'll be the testing now. Uh, you have a uh, battery, battery clip, and then you can actually house all these wires. Uh, the all you need to do is uh, eject the voltage into the system. Uh, and then the system reports that we have uh, uh, the room temperature in now is at uh, 28.3 degrees and uh, the humidity here is 78.2 percent uh, we can naturally test uh, for variation when uh, the conditions uh, 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 is on so Zion is on and uh, we can uh, uh, wait for for the heater to heat up a bit. And then we can bring that to the system. Expect that uh, it should be able to generate the temperature right now. 28.4. Uh, 28.5. And then the temperature keeps increasing. 28.6. We can actually bring it here. 28.9. 29. 9.3 and as it senses the temperature and the temperature value increases the humidity value too 
uh, changes especially measuring 30 degrees right now uh, 30.4 30.5 and on and on, on and on, the temperature will keep increasing until the maximum value that the DHT22 can actually uh, uh, measure. The relative value to keep increasing. Okay. Right. And another way we can actually get this temperature into it is to actually blow the hot air to it. We can. And that increases the temperature to 32 degrees. A gas in cooking, and so does the military value. If we eject this from it, we find the temperature begin to begin to reduce, uh, and uh, the humidity value also changes. So that's that's basically uh, uh, what the system is intended for. Uh, of course, the in in a subsequent modification, we will be interfacing the system with heater with uh, an air conditioner <laughs> and uh, uh, with a fan i don't know the air conditioner but of course the idea would be to measure uh, the environment uh, the atmospheric uh, 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 quantities which could be temperature and humidity and with uh, a set uh, value in it we'll be able to actually either hone the data to actually increase the temperature of the environment and hold the data and then hone the fan to actually push that temperature around and keep it steady. Uh